Hello guys, Chris here and welcome back to another video with this one my friends I'm gonna be testing a GeForce GTX 1650 4GB GDDR5 in Call of Duty Warzone Pacific in the Caldera map this time around It's been a while since I tested the 1650 uh, The game has gotten several updates and it's running a little bit differently of course So we're retesting it today So we're running it with the latest NVIDIA drivers right here 511.79 I'm not overclocking the GPU manually This is the Gigabyte Mini ITX OC model of the card it comes already overclocked out of the box as the name suggests over in tech power ups gpu z you can check out all of the gpu specs as i told you it's the gddr5 model of the card the gddr6 model is around 10 percent faster and we're pairing it with a ryzen 9 x and 32 gigabytes of ram just to avoid any bottlenecks in the system and so we make the 1650 the bottleneck which is what we're testing after all so let's get right into the game shall we oh man what a shame look at that 70 frames per second oh oh there we go 60 <laughs> that's beautiful oh <coughs> sorry i'm still sick okay but let's do this 1080p resolution at first i'm not sure if we're gonna test out like low resolutions 900p and 720p maybe if we don't get 60 plus all of the time at 1080 i will drop it and we're starting off with the lowest settings as you can see i enabled these two caches because they actually provide you with a couple of more fps and uh, better stability so i recommend you to enable them all right okay no this is this is not very good guys Actually, it is because we're right around 69 FPS, but uh, <laughs> aside from that, I th this is a massive drop in performance compared to the last time that I tested Warzone in this card. It is insane. All right, let's try to do our magic. This is a very beautiful gun, actually. Oh, oh there he is. What the? What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, he's shooting somebody else. Maybe this is this is the way. Yeah, let's just let's go around here and try to get him from behind. No, you know what? Getting people from behind is not good, actually. Ooh, these textures are terrible. <laughs> Granted, we're playing on low settings, so that's okay. That's all right. Well, look at this. Oh my God. Okay, <laughs> I was just gonna say, look at. How did I die? Oh, okay. All right, sniper boy. I was gonna say, looking at the entire city, we were still not really dropping from 60 frames per second. So that's that's all right, you know. You, you can play this game absolutely fine at 1080p low settings with the 1650, which is good to know. But it's not really gonna be a very competitive experience because in explosions and like, it's so close to 60 that it might drop, you know? Yeah, I remember getting like, what? 80 FPS on average with a 1650 before? Something like that. Uh-oh, uh-oh, they're dropping here. Oh, no, 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 this is, this is unfair, you know? They are seeing me from above. You bastard! All right, we're dropping again. Oh boy, look at that. We finally found the spot where it actually does drop by quite a bit. Look at this. In the mid 50s. That is very underwhelming, guys. Oh man, I'm sad right now because I got into this thinking that I was gonna play at 1080p and even test like medium settings, but Mark, what? I, I went bullets. I. Uh, never mind, okay. <laughs> oh, look at the averages, by the way. 69 FPS again. Now, the game is looking way better than it did before. Let's, uh, let's, let's talk a little bit about that as well. It's more demanding, but it's also more beautiful. But I guess that's all due to the saturation increase here. Uh, not really the... Oh, my God. All right, finally, finally. We're back in the game, guys. Yes. Let's use a sniper rifle here. No, no, no. Of course he has friends. Oh, oh, how did I do that? How did I do that? <laughs> nice. That was really good. Let's see. Is he behind? No, no. Oh, what? <laughs> he was behind us. And it's the same guy who killed us before. Damn. Dude, what are you doing with that little pistol? It looks like a toy gun and he kills everybody with it. Okay, so if the same guy kills me again here, I will call him a cheater <laughs> in the teleporter or whatever. All right, anyways, looking at the entire city, it does drop, but there are a few areas down there that are uh, as intensive as this, which is weird. So it means that the game is not really that well optimized. And to be honest, it never was. Or uh, it was, but back in the beginning, you know, in season one. Actually, they called it season one like three or four times already, which is super weird. Uh, it's because of the integration with the games, I guess. 
But yeah, season one of Call of Duty Warzone with Modern Warfare. Yeah, uh, it was actually pretty well optimized in that I was impressed with the performance that you could get, like 100 frames per second on average with 1650 on low settings. And now we're down to 69, which is a really good number, of course, everybody knows about it, but it's just not really that smooth. Oh, wait a second. Is this the weapon? No, no, that's it's nothing to do with the weapon that we got killed with. All right, I'm just gonna throw this out like Lock randomly there. Rain yeah, and let's That's just go point. away now. So even though it drops from 60 frames per second, guys, I think you should still play this game at 1080p resolution with the 1650 because most of you will have 1080p monitors with a card like this and it is, in fact, a very playable and enjoyable experience. I mean, I could even play the game with a 650 Ti boost, uh, which is a 90-year-old card, and I could wipe an entire squad with it with, like, 40 FPS at 800 by 600. So this is definitely way better than that, and you can for sure have fun with it. Also, another thing is, the game is not stuttery whatsoever, so although it does drop every now and again it is not a problem it's still a smooth experience most of the time and uh, i like that so we got a little bit of water here and it seems like yeah it is intensive isn't it like uh maybe some areas of the river are more intensive than others but yeah the, the water is definitely intensive you're dropping close to 60 frames per second and it does drop from 60, so uh, it's a perfect time to drop it down to 900p and see if it still drops. All right, so 1600 by 900, the best resolution ever because it has a 6 and a 9. We're almost there, by the way. And <laughs> uh, we're, getting, we're, we're still using the same settings, of course. Oh, boy, this, this is way better, actually. 69, 70, 72 at times. Not bad whatsoever. We got like 10 or 12 more FPS, and this might be what it takes for us to get a 60 plus FPS experience at all times, basically. Ah, I, I really wanted to get there with the parachute. Not gonna happen, though. All right, let's go back to the capital area there and try to kill our nemesis, the guy with the toy gun. My team is in the top 10. My team is me. How am I in the top 10? That's beautiful, that's amazing. I'm not even playing the objective, you know? <laughs> now the problem is they might be camping around here and we're in the top 10 again for the third time. This is weird. <laughs> well, if you must have that 60 FPS experience, uh, 60 plus, you know, all of the time, you can definitely have it here with the 1650 still, even though the game is much more demanding than it was before. Yeah, it's still possible, no problems whatsoever. It doesn't look as good as 1080p, obviously, but, well, that's to be expected, I guess. All right, let's see. They're up here. Maybe we can spot somebody from here. Never mind. The guy decided to vault instead of just jumping on, on the ledge, but hey, all right. Anyways, let's, let's go. Oh, there's a guy here. Okay. Oh my God, I missed everything. <laughs> that was really bad. <laughs> and now we're probably gonna die, guys, because he has friends, you know. All right, wait a second. All right, come on. Where is he? He's probably up here, right? No, not here, on top of us. There he is, there he is, you damn boy, you're dead, aha. I'm hearing shots, are they for me though? I don't really know. <laughs> I'm hearing a sniper with a silencer, I think. Oh, yes, they are for me now. All right. Oh, I, I have no idea where the guy is. What the hell? Oh, we got a UAV, that's nice. Okay, if only I didn't have go. all of the stats in front of the map, I could actually do something with it. Oh, wait, the guy is very close to us. Oh, maybe up here. Oh, this is very risky. Oh, boy. All right, there he is. Saw him. Come on. Let's go, buddy. Pick me. Enemy got a guy? No. <laughs> Uh-oh, dropping here. Hi, dude. Yo, bastard! I got my revenge! This was the guy from the... Yes, the toy gun! I'm gonna grab that... Ooh, cluster strike! No, 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 Oh, my gosh. No, I don't... Oh, man, come on! That was a nice shot, I think. Yeah, two of them were camping there. See? Camping bastards. We gotta get our revenge, guys. Oh, there they are! There they are! Oh, boy! Okay, this is bad. This is really bad. All right, let's just... Oh, hi, dude! Again! 
Are you serious? How are you dropping at the same time as me? Okay, so I think that's where they are, guys. Can we do... No? No, that's not where they are. Am I gonna die with my own... No. <laughs> Thank God. Okay, they're there. All right. Where's the other bastards? Uh, the bad thing is, I'm always without shields when I drop here because they shoot me while I'm flying. Oh, there, there they are. There they are. One down. Oh, 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 boy. Oh, wait a second. They're dropping. They're dropping somewhere. Oh, there they are. Come on, bro. We're pinned down here. Go. Oh, of course, we died. That's an SMG from that distance. Doesn't make sense. Is that the guy? What the hell is that? Oh, it's a shield or something. All right. Be scared, boy. Be scared. Oh, he died. Nice. No, he didn't die. Not that one. Okay, this could be a little bit higher, you know. Nice! Downed him. Alright, he didn't die. Of course, I did die. <laughs> Anyways, that's it for 900 feet. Never drops from 60 frames per second, thankfully. It is 720p time. Look at this. This actually looks pretty damn good, the water, you know. I'm really glad that they finally fixed the washed out colors in this game now it looks very saturated and colorful i really like it uh, but yeah look at that dropping into the 70s here at 720p resolution that's pretty interesting so we're still on the lowest settings aside from these and we're using the 1280 by 720 resolution right there and wow i it's Time just i expected way better coming from a 1650 guys the GDDR6 version, now that I think of it, will probably get 60 plus at 1080p. It won't really drop into the lower 50s or uh, mid 50s actually. But it won't really get you a high refresh rate experience even at 720p either. Wow. I mean, actually, I should have seen it coming because when I tested the 3050 in this map a couple of months ago, maybe a month ago or so, it was getting like 110 FPS average or 100 FPS average at 1080p resolution on low settings, which is pretty poor for a 3050 and like 1660 Ti and stuff like that. Those perform pretty much the same. Yeah, those FPS were what the 1650 was capable of when the game came out at 1080p. And now... A 3050 is needed for that, or a 1660 Ti, which are basically double the performance of this card. That's just insane. It's horrible optimization with every season in this game. I mean, at least it doesn't stutter, I'll give them that, but yeah, I, I just expected way better here, guys. Oh my gosh, I can't drive cars in games in general. <laughs> I'm really bad at driving in games. Dropping into the 80s at times. All right, that is nice. Okay, it's not too bad driving around with this. There's a guy there, or a couple of them. Hello, one down. Oh, this is where I killed a ton of people, actually. Let's try to get them bastards. Oh, they're, they're putting their things there. All right, another one down. Oh, come on, come on. Wait, I got a Semtex. <gasps> there he is. No, 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 boy. All right, all right, all right. I, I downed him. Oh, man, he got me with the grenade. That wasn't too bad, though. Hi, buddy. Come on. All right, wait a second. Okay, we got his shields, which is nice, because we don't have a lot of shields. Let's use this. Oh, uh, they're dropping around here as well. There he is. Come on, man, no. Let's go. Where are the ambitious? There he is, one of them, two of them. Ah, ran out of bullets. I guess basically we're getting like, what? 10 more FPS, maybe 20 more FPS than the, the 900p resolution, which is, a, oh, there was the other guy there. Oh, come on, man, they're everywhere. Yeah, 10 to 20 more FPS than 900p, and considering that this looks way worse than 900p, I, I, I don't know if I would do this, guys. Why do some of them outline, get an outline when I shoot them, and others don't? I don't know, like, look at that. That's really weird. Shouldn't that be like a perk on my end? Yeah, maybe they have like a counter for that or something. Oh, there's a guy there. 
Alright. Goodbye, buddy. You are gonna die with a grenade. Yeah, boy. And I need to be careful. Somebody was sh looking at me. Uh, where? Where? Now this is where the disadvantages come from the 720p resolution. I can't really spot the guy. <laughs> Everything looks really pixelated and fuzzy and shimmery, you know? There he is. Oh, come on. <laughs> well, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. We've seen enough already. I wouldn't really play at 720p, basically. I think 900p might be the sweet spot for a 1650 if you prefer the visuals and uh, to make out people better at the distance and stuff. Well, 1080p is the way to go. It still performs pretty well there. And well, guys, I'll catch you in the next one very soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. As always, I love you all. Bye bye.